Um, we got the Rockwell 6C on the on the three plate. Where is it? I don't know if you can see it there or not. Where is it? It's on this side. <laughs> how do you guys, how do they get those guys do that? Anyway, trust me, it's a three. It's on the three. All right, guys, here we go. I can't be the I can't be the guy that has a shaving channel that doesn't shave, right? So now I told you guys the logistics of this has been kind of a pain in the butt. Um, I've got my phone hanging from the towel rack and the shower is right here next to me. Here's the door. The wall's right there behind me. I'm sitting in a chair. Um, just, just bear with me. Okay, so this will be my first shave. Uh, first shave of the day of, of my of my channel. Okay, so today we're going to use the Simpson T3. I've had it sitting here in the in some water. Um, I got my my bowl that my wife gave me for my birthday. We'll set this on top. My washing machine's right here. Um, we've got Taylor of Old Bond Street uh, uh, tobacco leaf. This will be the first first shave with that. And I'm using the Rockwell 6C on the three blade, the three plate. There you go, working out on the three plate with a blue Astra. Okay, this will be the first shave with that too. Uh, the first blue Astra on three. All right, so let's do this. All right, so the, the way I make my, my is I just kind of swirl this around in here. Um, not a whole lot. I think that's enough. Yeah, yeah, it's more than enough. Okay. Um, I'll take my bowl, I'll put a little bit of water in it, just a touch, just a smidge, and then I pour the water out. Okay, so just so there's just kind of like residual water in there. All right, then let's just go to town. Now, when I make my lather, I don't really mash the bowl or mash the brush down into the bowl. Um, I work more on the outside and kind of scrubbing back and forth. And, you know, like... <clears throat> When I first started lathering like this, it was about, I don't know, like eight years ago. Um, I was having some really, really bad beard dandruff. And uh, maybe I'll put a picture in here. That's me sitting in the parking lot at Costco one day. And I had, uh, I had said to my wife, I said, man, my beard's itching. I started scratching it. And looked down, I just had... <laughs> <clears throat> all this dandruff. So I started looking into it. I put some water in here. Um, some water the way the way Kevy does, just add the drops, right? Oh, 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 oh. Um, so um, I had all that beard dandruff on my shirt. So I started looking into it, and it said one cause could be shaving cream um, because it's got. You know, shaving cream in an aerosol can's got alcohol in it, and it can dry your skin out. I said, "Well, that sounds like a like a culprit." Um, look at this! Oh, it looks so good. Um, so that's when I started looking into um, wet shaving. Now I stuck with a with a uh, cartridge razor all these years, um, but I always kind of wanted to try the the safety razor. Just never, just never pulled the trigger because the razors themselves were so expensive. A little more water in here. Um, the razors, you know, seemed expensive and I didn't want to spend that kind of money. Um, but then last year I was, uh, I was watching some YouTube channels and came across this guy shaving. You guys ever heard of the Chaps Guide? Um, it's a British guy. Anyway, he, um. He was out in his yard. <laughs> he was out in his yard shaving, um, and uh, look at this. Oh, beautiful! All right, this is good enough for me. I like it like this. I like it just like that. Look at that. Oh, beautiful. Okay, so let me set this off to the side. I need to wet my face. Okay, so I came across the Chaps Guy channel, and um, he was out in his garden shaving, and. Uh, he was using Taylor of Old Bond Street, and I think it was the Ode scent. Now, up until this time, I'd been using the Colonel Conk pucks, those real hard hockey pucks for like seven, eight years, right? Um, 
And when he showed that, I was like, oh, what's this? And he made his lather. And when he put it on, it was like, whoa, like a big wall of just paste. And I was like, holy, that's, that's what I want. Um, so I ordered some Taylor. Um, from his recommendation, he recommended uh, uh, tobacco leaf. I couldn't get oat at the time, so that's why I went with the tobacco leaf. And I got the sandalwood just to try it. Um, fell in love with both of them, you know. Um, so, and then I just had a, just got owed about about a week or so ago, maybe two weeks ago. Um, all right, so let's let's lather this bad boy up. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh my god, oh, I'm gonna make a mess here. Mm, get on my shirt. Yeah. Yeah, I love this lather. This is so good. So much better than Colonel Conk. Um, but, you know, Jesus Christ. Um, <laughs> you, and, you know, the other thing is, guys, I'm not used to shaving like this. I shave in the shower. So this is all... I haven't shaved sitting in front of a mirror in years. Years. This is so weird to me. And I'm not used to this mess dropping on me because I guess in the shower, it just runs off, you know, but now I've got shit down on my shirt. And, oh my God. Up on my shoulder. What a mess. Hmm. We may have to do something about this. Hold on guys. Yeah, that's not fun. Okay. Set that up there for now. Anyway. So that's good enough. That's good enough. All right, all right. Like the people at Simpson say, that brush is for <coughs> is for uh, painting. All right, so here we go. All right, am I in the camera? Turn it a little bit this way. All right, okay. All right. Oh, the blue aster. The aster's not bad. It's pretty comfortable. Huh. No, I'll tell you guys a secret. Um, I actually go against the rules here. Um, I usually go down all the way around, and then I go across, and then I go up. But you know what? This hair here grows that way. So actually, this is growing down. This is growing that way, and this is kind of, down here is kind of growing that way. This stuff in the middle is kind of wishy-washy. Um, so I'm actually going to cross the grain here. Um, and the, the, a week or so ago, when I when I cut myself really bad, <laughs> was bleeding, I had tried to do this, and I hit something back there and cut it. I'm not like, yeah, it's not worth it. All right, so... Yeah, so, and sorry, I'm not used to talking while I'm doing this, so if I get quiet for a second, just bear with me. I'll get used to it. Oh, you know what? I've been... I've been shaving with that Vikings blade this week. What a huge difference this is. Huge difference. Oh my God, <clears throat> it's so smooth, it's so smooth. Okay, now normally in the shower, I would rinse this off before doing this, but it's just a big mess here. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go for round two. Any bleeders? Nope, we're safe on the first round. Okay, all right. Okay, here we go. All right. Yeah, I can hear that. Oh, that sounds good. It, it sounds, I, I can literally hear, that's another thing, like, because I'm in the shower, the water's running, I can't hear it. I'm getting a lot of feedback this time. I can hear the blade. You know, that might, 
you know, I might have to start doing this so I can get used to it. Maybe this is how I find a good angle, you know? Oh, that sounded good. Feels good, too. Man, this is so smooth. This is the Astro Blue on a three. Um, I can tell I didn't clean that up. You can still hear it. All right. That's okay. Hmm? Okay. Sorry, guys. I don't like to, I don't like to let this load up and get six tons of foam hanging off of it. Mm. Sounds good. Sounds good. This, yeah, this feels nice. Sorry, Vikings Blade. I think you're going to lose out. Um, I was going to give up on one of them, but uh, I don't. I don't think it's going to be this one. Wow, this is really nice. Mm. Wow, you take a week off from it and you really realize how good it is. All right. Now, if you guys see any irritation, I want to tell you a little secret. This is my second shave today. Um, I had a I had to go to a lesson this afternoon, so I've already had a three pass shave for today. This is more like a huge cleanup, um, but still give you an idea of how I shave, right? All right. Next is the up. Mmm. Sounds good. Mmm. <laughs> I think I went into my sideburn there. <laughs> uh. The water's running. Uh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to do the, in honor of Geo Fat Boy, clear the runways, whoosh, whoosh, right? Guys, that is a three pass shave. Let's see what we've got. Let me rinse off here real quick. see what we got oh yeah well you know what I had some spots that I had missed earlier um yeah right here I could still you could probably use a little cleanup right there let's let's give it a try I probably should, I probably should have wet that first I bet that's gonna drag all right Got it. Okay. All right. All righty. All righty, all righty, all righty.
All right, so there we go. I got to through my first shaving video. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, can't wait to see the comments, you guys tearing me up over it. <laughs> Things I did wrong or whatever. Um, I'm just going to use some witch hazel. Anybody ever put this in the refrigerator? I wonder if this feel like cold. Oh, that feels good. Mm. Now, normally, when, I, when I'm in the shower and I finish shaving, I will squeeze the soap out of the brush and wash my face with it. Um, but, we can do that here. Okay, so next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to just run my brush under the water here, get the soap out of it. Um, I've actually got the brush pointed up with the water running into it. It's not real hot. It's just, I mean, I can put my hands in it. It doesn't hurt. So, um, and then I just swipe it out a little bit. And then I do one of these things. <clears throat> yeah. Just kind of gently go over that like that. Yeah, there we go. That'll keep that in order. And then take the, the bowl and rinse that out. All right, guys. Well, there we go. Um, I don't know if I told you guys this or not. Well, I mean, I know I did, but I don't know how many of you paid attention to it. I've actually got another YouTube channel with about hey, almost 9,000 subscribers. Um, and I've got close to 2,000 videos up there, maybe 1,800, something like that. And I was actually nervous tonight making this video, you know? Um, but my wife said, why, why are you gonna make a video tonight? You shave today. And I said, well, I don't have time to do it tomorrow. And uh, I can't be the guy that has a shaving channel on YouTube that doesn't shave. All right, so... Uh, yeah, I want to thank you guys so much for all your help. And uh, maybe we'll make this a weekly thing. Maybe uh, every Saturday night I'll come in here and have a shave. Uh, from now on, I will not shave on Saturday. Um, I'll shave Friday morning before I go to work. Next weekend, I'm actually off work next Friday. So I can not shave on Friday and Saturday and actually have some good stubble to go with. Um, all right, guys. Well, 17, 17 and a half minutes, that's not too bad. Um, again, thank you guys so much for all your help on, on the on the shave group. Um, I really appreciate all the advice you guys have given me. Um, yeah, let's have some fun. All right, so um, one other thing, guys. I don't usually say rate, comment, and subscribe. That's not my style. Um, but I'm going to ask you to subscribe now because I need 50. If once I get 50, some things will unlock on the channel and I'll be able to do live broadcasts and stuff like that. So once we get to 50, I won't ask again unless there's some other hoop that I have to jump through with some number. OK, but I for my channel, I would rather have 10 loyal subscribers that watch my videos and comment and we have a good time than a million faceless people that I have no idea who they are. Um, my video views. Yeah. Nobody puts up a video not wanting views, okay? We all want to get views. But I tell you what, if I've got 50 subscribers, if I can get 50 views, meaning my people are watching, I'm good with that, okay? So uh, the one thing I will ask you to do is leave a comment, anything. Tell me about your day, whatever it is. I want to get to know you guys. I want this to be a community. I want this to be us, all right? So uh, anyway, thanks again, guys. And uh, yeah, yeah I'll, I'll be putting videos up this week, but uh, shave next next week, uh, maybe same time. And uh, yeah, we'll see. Yeah. So how is this upload time for this? Is this good? Leave that in the comment for me. Right. Help me with this. When is a good time for me to upload videos? All right. OK, guys, have a good night. Good day. Whatever it is, wherever you're at. See ya.